So how long does it take to set up poultry nets? I have no idea. I'm fixing to find out. They say one person can do it in 10 minutes. But since I've never done this before, I think it's gonna take longer. But I have my boys to help me. This is the fence we got. Got the poultry net, 12483. And it was the kit where it came with the solar charger. This is the IntelliShock 60. And I bought four corner posts for extra strength since it's really windy in Oklahoma. So, I'm gonna use the corner posts just to, as a marker. Since it's 100 foot long, we're gonna go just a 25 foot square. So, we'll see how it goes. the hardest part was measuring the right length but I have room for a gate now maybe I should order one this does not seem very big for 33 chickens we're gonna have 33 chickens in here I feel like I need to order one more hundred foot net I don't know we'll see we haven't got our chicken tractor built yet but with it in here and 33 chickens, it seems like it's not gonna be that much space. So I might go ahead and order another 100 foot roll. I'm thinking, I don't know. They're in the coop and the chicken run right now. So um, we used to have them free ranging everywhere and then we lost 25 hens last summer to coyotes and bobcats. So. And I don't like them in the run. I like them on the green grass. So we're going to see how this works. I also got 200 feet of the hog net, which I'm starting to think won't be enough for our four sows either. So we'll see. We'll see how this goes. But it was easy. It was easy to put up. It really was. I just didn't measure right, so it's kind of off. But there is space for a gate, which I thought would be better because this is so high, it's going to be kind of hard to climb over. Let's see here. Yeah, you could probably... I mean, these, these are like really flexible. <laughs> I'm trying to climb over. This, this is funny in itself. No, my foot went through. Okay. Now it's all coming down. We got the tall one. This was recommended by Premier One uh, because we have so many stray dogs and coyotes that get them. And they said this would be the best to keep those out. Here's a close up what it looks like. The smaller, you can see my hand. These are smaller at the bottom and then they get bigger going up. So, Chicks should stay in that when they're probably a month old. I don't know that they could fit through there at a month old. Now we can see how hard it is to roll it up. Okay, that was harder than putting it up, but I think if more practice that would be okay. I think I should have done the outside of it too because <laughs> the way the posts were going it was like hard to hold them and I kept dropping them. So let's see how this goes. I don't think I did it right. The fencing is caught on some of the stakes. Well, that didn't turn out like I thought it would. I might have to set it up and redo it. I think I might just redo it. Let's just say it doesn't look like the picture did when you uh, take it down.
just makes perfect, right? didn't come today but that was a little better the last four it gets heavy and I keep dropping them and I don't know I still don't know if I'm doing it right so maybe I'll watch a premiere win video okay it is later in the day it was really hot earlier it's like 80 degrees so it's cooler and I'm gonna try this again I watched the video on premiere one how to take it down as doing it all wrong so third time's charm right one-handed our soul is too hard so I'm gonna do it this way tangled okay Brian help me and this is what it looks like after two people doing it but my battery's about dead and my cards full so if you got two people use them first time doing the fence that's my experience easy to set up harder to take down and I feel like I need more I don't feel like this is gonna be long enough for 33 chickens but we'll see if you're considering premier one fencing I hope this helps in some way 